Hello everyone, today I am going to show you how to connect Node.js with MS SQL Server using both Windows Authentication as well as SQL Server Authentication. And especially this video is made as a reply for the comment made by Nikhil Herlagi. He wants to know how to connect the database using the server, SQL Server Authentication. Uh, first of all, uh, we will start with Windows Authentication. and to understand it properly, please watch the video from start to end. If you miss any step, uh, you might get some error. Uh, you can see this is the window authentication. I will connect it and so my predefined database. I have just made test database and inside that we have a table called table students. Just you can see and select top. You can view the information inside it. Uh, just move on to the code. First of all, we will start from the beginning and pm in it, and we have to pass some general information. I will just use it as it is. Just write as, and you can see the package.json file. Now we have to install some dependencies. The dependencies are MS SQL and and the driver package MS SQL node v8. Just type the command npm install MS SQL and save. It will install the dependencies for the MS SQL. It will take a little few time. Uh, while it's taking time, you just create a file called index.js file as it is the main file uh, which will be called the installation takes time as per the speed of, of your network since the inst installation is going on let's start our code uh, first of all, we will create a con connection to the SQL as connection SQL is equal to require ms SQL slash ms mode SQL v8. What is the spelling mistake? Uh, we have to install the another package called npm install ms node sql b8 save it as we are using ms sql and ms node sql b8 as a driver then after we will config our database and inside the config we will write your server and to get the server just log out and then connect again and you can find the server name if you, uh, sometimes you can only get your desktop name in at that time just use a backslash and write this sql script express copy this and just paste it here while pasting it just focus here you have to make double backslash then our database name test db then after driver we are using the driver ms node sql p8 and options inside that option we have to make the connection trusted connection make it run our configuration is done and now since all is installed just close this SQL dot connect we will connect SQL 
with the config file and it will return a function and if there is error we will catch it uh, console the error and if not it will move on so we will make a request and query through the request and query is left on from the simple query to show you on the query we will return function either the error or the records if error control the error else so console the logs reports just it is done save it this oh sorry save it and run the command node index dot yes oh, so, oh okay okay what is missing I uh, ms node sql b8 okay it was not installed properly i have typed it wrong install the spelling was the mistakes i, I have to reinstall please npm install minus ta rather install ms sql no v8 since the dependency is not installed so it has generated the error please type your command correctly now it's installing and this node in this Okay, what is the issue? npm inst again. I have made same npm install. It was simply a spelling mistake of installs. Sorry for that. And just uh, okay. I will clear this screen to show you. Just type node index dot this you can see the information is there uh, now for the answer of uh, Nikhil Garg I will show you how to use a, a SQL server authentication uh, if you already have changed your SQL server authentication then it's okay but I'm doing from scratch then first of all uh, do the Windows authentication connect it and inside this security you can see the login options and click right click over SA and choose the properties inside that properties you have the general information uh, as we can't change the login name but we can change our own password I'm using a, my own password suppose one two three four five six seven eight just any password one two three four five six seven it okay uh, one thing more you have to do, do it or uh, properties and go to a status and uh, if it is first time it was it is already disabled you have to enable it 
if it is disabled just enable it okay just reconnect using the SQL server authentication and type the login name assay and your password just connect now it is connected now inside the code you have to just change a few things that is user and inside user our user is assay and password password is simple save this and rerun the command node index.js you can see the information is here thank you for watching this please like share and subscribe my video i will upload the videos regarding electron js and other uh, problems if you have any problem please comment me i will solve for you thank you for watching